Hi, my name is Vincent and today I want to take a look at the mathematical significance of the number of the beast, 666. Now, just for a little bit of background, although most of you probably already know, the number 666 in Christianity refers to the number of the beast, or as we could call the beast, the Antichrist. So, in some sense, this is the unholiest of numbers. Now, to analyze the mathematical significance of this number, I want to consider the divine proportion, also known as the golden ratio. And this number we denote by the Greek letter phi equals 1.618. 0339887. In other videos, I do explore this number in greater detail, but just know that it's a number that pops up all around the universe, and it's one of the most mathematically significant numbers that we have, and its nickname is the Divine Proportion. So, let's see how we could explore this number 666. So, using a pocket calculator, you could type the expression sine of 666 degrees plus cosine of 6 times 6 times 6 degrees and you could punch this entire expression right into your calculator but to see how it simplifies just so you could follow along easier the sine of 666 degrees is negative 0.809016 437. And also, the cosine of 6 times 6 times 6 degrees, if we simplify this, this is the cosine of 216 degrees, that's the result of multiplying 6 times 6 times 6, and when we evaluate the cosine of 216 degrees, we should get the same thing. We get negative 0.809016996 so now when we add these two numbers together, the result will be negative 1.618-0339-887. And now this decimal will continue on for a few more places. It may continue on forever, but I'm pretty sure that this decimal terminates. But the point is, the mathematical significance of the number of the beast, now we can see it. When we use basic trigonometry, with the number of the beast, notice how the value of this expression here is the additive inverse of the golden ratio. So if we analyze this a little bit closer, this tells us that an expression here that uses the number of the beast results in the additive inverse of the golden ratio. So that tells us that the number of the beast in some sense is the inverse of the holiest number that exists and mathematics. So it's just a really interesting relationship that exists when we use the sine and cosine functions, but using your calculator, we could generate the inverse of the divine proportion using the number of the beast. So, okay, well this is going to conclude this video on analyzing the mathematical significance of the number of the beast. Thank you all for watching, and I hope that this was enjoyable.